obviously, Facebook can manipulate its algorithms to attract users. Um, and I guess my question would be, do you feel, in your humble opinion, that you know, simply maximizing profits, no matter the societal impact, that that, that is justified? Um, and I think the question then would be, that, that's the, the short question, which I think I know the answer. What impact uh, Facebook's bottom line would it have if the algorithm was changed to promote safety uh, and to, instead of, to pr change to, to, to save the lives of young women rather than putting them at risk? I'm learning about the talk button. Um, Facebook today uh, has a, a, a profit, is, uh, makes approximately $40 billion a year in profit. A lot of the changes that I'm talking about are, are not going to make uh, Facebook an, an unprofitable company. It just won't be a ludicrously profitable company like it is today. Um, Engagement-based ranking, which causes those amplification problems that leads young women from you know, innocuous topics like healthy recipes to anorexia content, um, if it were removed, face, people would consume less content on Facebook, but Facebook would still be profitable. And so uh, I, I, I encourage oversight and public scrutiny into how these algorithms work and the consequences of them. Right. Well, uh, and I appreciate that. Obviously, I think the, the Facebook business model puts, uh, well, poses risk to, to youth and to, and to teens. Uh, you care to, compared it to cigarette companies, which I thought was rightfully so. Um, if this, I guess the question is, is this level of risk appropriate? Uh, or is there a level of risk that would be appropriate? I think there is an opportunity to reframe some of these oversight actions. So when we think of them as these trade-offs of like it's either profitability or safety, I think that's a false choice. And then in reality, the thing I'm asking for is a move from short-termism, which is what Facebook is run under today, right, is being led by metrics and not led by people. And that with appropriate oversight and some of these constraints, it's possible that Facebook could actually be a much more profitable company five or 10 years down the road because it wasn't as toxic, not as many people quit it. But that's one of those counterfactuals that we can't actually test. So regulation might actually make Facebook more profitable over the long term. Um, so the idea that 20% you know, of your users could be facing uh, serious mental health issues and that's not a problem is shocking. Um, I also want to emphasize for people that, that eating disorders are serious, right? There are going to be women walking around this planet in 60 years with brittle bones because of choices that, fa that Facebook made around emphasizing profit today.